Welcome back to my channel. Today, I'm going to show you how to make a Princess Tiana centerpiece and setup. Here we go. Centerpiece. All right, let's get started. To make the base of my centerpiece, I'm going to need a hanging basket and three of these very, very cute frog soap dispensers from Dollar Tree. And usually, this basket comes with a chain, a hanging chain, but I must have used it in something else uh, because I have no idea where it is. Uh, but good, you know, because you're going to dispose of that, you don't need it, and you're also going to dispose of the pumps. Uh, for the soap dispensers and then you are going to attach the basket to the soap dispensers or to your froggies here so you are going to turn this over and then you are going to position your frogs there's this uh, hoop or little loop here you can position those loops uh, under the frogs and actually it can help you uh, guiding you in where to glue uh, your baskets to the frog so go ahead and use that so grab your hot glue and glue your basket to the frog now I'm going to get started with her ball gown she um, actually came with a very cute dress but this is not big enough for a centerpiece so I'm going to make her a huge, huge gown, a huge ball gown. I almost want the feel to be like a old fashioned quinceanera dress, <laughs> cause you know those can be very, very big. So um, yeah, so I'm going to make it out of tool. And in most of her pictures, the bottom of her dress is yellow. So I'm going to start with yellow. And I am going to use ribbon to attach the tool to the basket. You want to measure almost at the very top and give yourself a little room because you're going to need to tie it at the very end. So somewhere around right here will be perfect. There you go. And then you're going to have to measure the length of tool you're going to need. And that's going to be from the table to the point where you're going to have your ribbon. And then you're going to double that up because you're going to have to tie this. Okay, so you are going to need about this much. And now I'm going to go ahead and cut a few of these so I can start making my tool skirt. Here are my pieces of tool and now I'm going to start attaching them to my ribbon. All you have to do is bend your tool in half, making this loop here. Then you are going to place it over the ribbon. Then you are going to bring the top part over to the bottom. And then you are going to put this bottom part inside the loop. And then you are going to pull. with my skirt or I should say the bottom part of my gown this is going to be huge oh my gosh I love it <laughs> um, I can tie it here I have to bring the whole thing together and I do have to trim it because it's a little too long and a little too wild so I'm going to do that right now And here it is, 
little trim it looks much much better and it looks more tame uh, you can also see uh, the legs of the frogs I'm not sure if you can see it on screen um, but I can see it in person and I think it's fabulous now I'm going to move on to my green tool and for that I'm going to need the assistance of Princess Tiana herself <laughs> um, I am going to place her here for now she'll be falling a little bit she's gonna to have to sit a little higher but that will happen as soon as I place the other tools I need to measure the amount of ribbon I'm going to need around her and I'm going to measure it right around her hip and hopefully the tool that I'm going to uh, the skirt that I'm going to make here with tool will hold her up but most likely I'm going to have to place something underneath to keep her up so I'm going to cut here and this is going to be about the amount I'm going to need to make the top skirt or the rest of her gown and I'm going to do the same as I did with the yellow skirt so I'll be right back before I show you my green tool skirt, I want to point out that I painted my basket silver. Um, I actually painted it with my metallic silver marker, but um, the best thing for you to do is do this at the very beginning. <laughs> um, paint it metallic silver and then, you know, attach the frogs and then move on. I thought that uh, placing both of the tools right on top will be enough to cover up the black wire and it did but I could still see it faintly in the background and it was totally bothering me so I decided to go ahead and paint it silver so yeah so now I'm going to move on to where I left off before I dress up Tiana with the green tool skirt to place right on top I'm going to cover up the wires here on the basket with some um, green tool and what I'm going to do is I am going to place it right inside here and then I'm going to bring it around and cover that wire up. I'm going to give you a close up. So again, all you have to do is place the tool inside here. So the wire will be in the middle of the tool. And then you are going to bring it in and through the tool. As so. this clear bowl to help me keep her up. I'm not sure yet whether I have to keep the bowl under there or you know if the dress is going to be uh, puffy enough to keep her up. So we shall see. All right, arms up. And here is my green tool skirt. And I'm just going to wrap it around her waist. Looking good, girl. Looking good. I'm going to give her a little trim. And here she is looking fabulous. I love it. I stopped trimming because I'm known to get carried away and I'm afraid to mess it up. So this is as good as my cutting skills go. So yeah, so I'm just going to leave it alone. Now to finish it up, I bought this, how do you call this? This is an ornament, a Christmas, Christmas ornament. But if you can see in all of her pictures and in the movie, she has these little antennas coming out of her tiara. Or I don't know what they are, but there's some little spiky things with little balls. Um, and I love it. But she doesn't have it on here for some reason. So I am going to place this right behind her so she can sparkle even more. 
So I'm going to cut this. Uh, let's cut here. And I'm going to put it through the back of her dress. stay in place and this is the final touch for my Tiana centerpiece love it now I'm going to move on to make table scatters out of this cute frog party favors I found at Dollar Tree. I'm going to glue these googly eyes on the frogs, but I'm only going to use the green ones and the yellow ones. I wish they had purple, but they didn't. But that's all right. I'm just going to take this out. You can also paint them in purple. There's three sizes of googly eyes in the bag. They have small, medium, and large. I'm only going to be using the small and medium. And I'm just going to grab my hot glue gun. And I'm just going to squeeze a little bit on top of the eyes. And then I'm going to just place them right on it. But looking up, you don't want it flat. You want it kind of like facing up as so very cute I'm also going to be using this very cute frog soap holder from Dollar Tree this is very cute I'm going to use this as part of my setup and I wanted to show it to you in case you're not a Dollar Tree goer and uh, you may think that I made this. Uh, this is actually like a set for the soap dispenser that's holding um, the gown up for Tiana. So that's the set to that, so part of the set. Um, all right, so I just wanted to show you that. Cute, right? Cute. Okay guys, this is it. This is my Princess Tiana centerpiece and some of the items I'm going to be using for my setup and I love it. I think she looks beautiful. She went from $7.95 to a million bucks. She looks beautiful. And the ornament in the back, perfect touch. And she's also sitting there all on her own. No bowl necessary. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure to give it a thumbs up if you like this video and make sure to subscribe if you haven't subscribed. Also, make sure to check out the TyraPerezProject.com for more inspiration and to check out my store. Until next time, bye.